Yo, what good, everybody? It's Hyper Shadow 01. Dexy Queen 01 here. And we're finally back with more Majora's Mask. Last time we did a bunch of stuff. We healed the uh, uh, Mikau. And we're just going to continue on to the main story. And then we have emotional damage from it. Yep. Pretty sad <laughs> stuff, actually. Right now, let's just put on a Zora Mask. And we have to go down to this way. So we're going to head to the Gorilla's Pirates where poor Mikau uh, fought valiantly. But oh god, not those things! I know, right? They're ugly, honestly. The fact that why are they underwater too? That's what they are. They're like well, aquatic creatures. They're aquatic, even though I see them in the in literally on the surface. Yeah, they are. They're aquatic. They're land and aquatic. Oh my god. Oops. Okay, so it's not uh, this way. We're going the wrong way. Go to the Gerudo's uh, pirates where Mikael fought valiantly, but and uh, well, he died. Yeah. Okay. Not there. So you have to come all the way over here and ram into one of these. There we go. Ah, uh, okay. So there was a passage. Yep. Okay. And that's how you enter the Gerudo Pirates Pirates Fortress. Is there Tetra? Oh, stop. Wrong game. Wrong game. <laughs> wrong, wrong game. Meanwhile, there's a good reason why I tell you with getting the stone mask earlier in the other parts. Because, mm -hmm. again, you are invisible to the enemy. Oh, true. It is the Gerudo. And, um, if, well, if you don't have it, just know that this will be twice as hard. Hold on to Stone Mask and you're good. I can land! Yeah! Alright, cool. First, I need to go over here. Because I'm gonna need this. So, earlier part about getting the Picto Box. I say this is important to get. It's part of, well, actually, yeah, it is part of the, it is important to get it for part of the main story. So, this is what I need. Snap a picture, keep this. Reason why, we'll get to that later on. In the meantime, let's just enjoy the ride. So, what we're gonna do, we're gonna find uh, this treasure item that we're going to need for exploring around here and later also in the temple as well. There is a question I have to ask. So. Is the mask really required to do this, or you could actually just skip ahead of it, actually? I, I would say it's optional. Oops. Right, I don't have the item for that. Hold up. Come over here, turn to a Goron Link. It's not, like, um, how can I say it? I mean, it's, op it's optional, like I said, but highly recommend it, because, again, to, to sneak around the Gerudo's, uh, the Guru Pirates Fortress right here. Um, it, it'll, it'll be it'll be a lot harder, you know, because you have to sneak your way. Mm, okay. So with that being said, ah. Oof. Oops. okay. So with that being said, the stone mask is very much like highly recommended to get. Because again, you get to sneak by through here with no problem. Mm -hmm. okay. All right, so we come through over here, so yeah. that we open up a path. Yeah, because I I just had to ask because it, it looks like you can actually just sneak away from the Gerudo, like even though, like they're you're right behind them, that you can still sneak past them. I mean, you can sneak past them, but. Um, how can I say this? Wait, I don't know if I did it right. Wow. I think you did. Maybe. Alright, surface. Alright, come over here. And then we can go through here. Yep. Let me see, what's in here again? Probably just some money. Yes, I got 20 bucks. <laughs> okay, so... Yeah, but yeah, um, it's not the senses, it's just, how can I say this, it's like you're prone to get caught easily even if you are behind them. Huh, okay. Like, you're, especially like if you're really close to them. Well, yeah, that's obvious. <laughs> yeah. But again, highly recommend it to get the stone mask. Alright, come over through here. Alrighty. 
Anything over here? Yes, no? Okay. I still like the fact that Nora Link actually swims like that. He goes really mm -hmm. fast, too. Oh, yeah, he's fast as underwater. Where are we? Alright, cool. Ooh, careful. Oh. Woohoo! Hey, money. Oh, wait, treasure. I bet you it's more money! <laughs> yep! 20 bucks! Yes! You have a bigger wallet now. And then I just saw a heart container. Yep! Of course, I'm just gonna do that. And that. Oops. Forget breaking those. Just to get it faster. <laughs> you could. You can do this with either the Bunny Hood or Warren Link. Either one can be faster. Okay. Ooh. Ooh, man. Nice. Cool. Got that. Alright, alright. We're making some good progress. I'm just gonna break that. Gonna get my Zora mask back again. Alright. Cool. And I meant you to do that. Meant to do that. I'm a pro. Don't judge me. You landed into the spikes. I'm a pro. Don't judge me. <laughs> I know what I did. Oh my god. I want to get her cause pain. <laughs> nah. <laughs> Let's see. Oh. Oh, right. Okay. Okay. Hmm. Pretty sure I can't get it. Nope. Gee, what do you think the first idea was? <laughs> Leave me alone, don't judge me. <laughs> I am best Zelda player ever now. Oh my god. <laughs> like, I, you would oh, think no. that's actually the first thing you should do is just basically step on the switch is why you couldn't be able to hit that thing shush i need to come back here again <laughs> yeah you're right see i have my dirt moments i have my dirt moments <laughs> careful Ooh. Ooh, you. there we go you were so close Woo! to hitting that and Mini boss time. Nope. Oh, never mind. Nope. I'm so used to it when it's painted to black. Sometimes it actually will be like a mini boss. I don't blame you for thinking that, to be honest. Let me see. I didn't want to see. Do I have enough? Yes, I do. Okay, cool. I love Weirdo. Here, definitely, when it comes to sneaking around and you see all those Gerudo guards. That I know, I feel like you need the Gerudo mask on. Gerudo mask? The stone mask. There's, there's honestly no Gerudo mask here. Wait, so the one in your inventory, that's not the Gerudo mask? No. Wait, which one? That this? one. Oh, that's never mind. Oh, I thought that was the Gerudo, sorry. Nah, you're good. And since they can, um, uh, they can, you know, throw you out. Yeah, F no. you. Also, when I mentioned the other parts about getting the stone mask, in the 3DS version, that guard that was invisible, he'd be laying around somewhere around here and you had to get to him very carefully in the 3DS version. And this is another spot to get the... Hey, hi phone, how you doing? This is another spot to get the stone mask. Again, 3DS version. But now we have the stone mask here. Let's just head up here because this is what we're ne where we need to go. English, professional, yay. Goodbye. Oh, this yeah. broad is in my way. Wait, can I go through here? Oh, so your mom texts us. Yeah, she's heading home? Yep. Oh yeah, this is the correct way. Cool. Actually, she's saying tacos. Or spaghetti. Alright, hold on. Before I get back to that, notice how there's a bee? That's a... That's a big bee. Yeah, that is. Oh, this one... Voice acting. I'll leave this one to you. Oh. I've been waiting for you? Oh! Yeah, not- Oh, oh, right. I've been waiting for you. <laughs> There's no question mark at the end. <laughs> Shut up. Please. And did you find the rest of the eggs? 
And see, that was a question mark. Yes, it was. I know. I'm. Listen, I'm good at my reading. <laughs> then you read it. This is females. <laughs> mm. No, but th that's because... What are you trying to pull here? If people hear the great fairies have lost the treasure they stole, we'll become the laughing stock. The great pirates. They're not fairies. Shut up. No. <laughs> then you read it. Look, woman. <laughs> no, you read it. Fine. Damn it. <laughs> yes, but, but Avail, the sea is strangely murky where we were attacked by the sea snakes. Silence. That's why the Zoras can't send for any help. Now that the eggs are gone, the Zoras should be frantically searching for them. If we don't hurry, the Zoras will get to them before we do. There are four eggs here now. Hurry! Go find the other three eggs before those sea snakes eat them. Understood- oh, oh. Understood. Yeah, you better. Wait! The Zora eggs are the only clue we have about the dragon cloud floating over the bay. If what that strange masked one says is true. <laughs> if we can get our hands on the treasure that lies sleeping in the temple in that dragon cloud, then we can spend the rest of our lives living the good life. So get a move on and go find them now. Understood. We have a good view of their leader's room from here. And I bet if you needed to, you could shoot an arrow through those bars. Yep. And speaking of eggs, hello, look at that over there. Stupid bars in the way. Thank you. Oh, that's the egg. Yep. Okay. And just like Tattle said, you saw that bee earlier? Yeah. Whoops, miss. Oh. I mean, I don't blame them. They're freaking giant bees. True. I wouldn't want to be in the same room as them. Oh, so you know what's asking about if you want to talk with our spaghetti? Uh. What are you in the mood for? I'm in the mood for tacos. I'm down with that. Now that, um, y'all saw all that. Actually, I don't think we need the stone mask for this one. We can just take this off real quick. I mean, you scared them off, so if anything, you yep. just probably stop free at this point. Well, for th in that room, yes. And now we can get the treasure that we what we need. You found the hook shot. Hey. You, you can use it to grapple items so you can reel them in or pull yourself over to them. Uh huh. That's good, that's good. And now that we have that, put over here, get our Zora mask. Now, not so long ago when I said, alright, do I have enough? Hold on. Oops. Hold on. Hey, turn around. There. <laughs> because why I said um, that we have enough, the pirate said we have four of them in here. And the earlier parts when I showed you guys, the viewers, on where to get some of these bottles, it's good to get at least four. Because right here in this area in the game, there, like that pirate said, there are four eggs here in the Gerudo Pirate's Fortress. And... dummy. So you need about, yeah, four bottles for this. Okay, that's... Okay, so then that is mandatory then. I mean, you can still do it with... with like three, maybe two bottles, but just know you're gonna have to backtrack back and forth. Uh, okay. <laughs> All right, that takes care of that. I think the the less worry, I think you should just at least get the four bottles in. Yeah, especially for this part. And now we need to look around for the other areas for the for the other um, Zora eggs. I'm guessing your, your, your editing skills is this one is like when I get mad you're gonna like put like some, some funny editing in there. That'll be good ideas. <laughs> That'll be good ideas. Yep. 
Oh, what? And... That was stupid of me. Alright. And... There's a hook shot for stuff like this. I could go through that way, but I want to see... You. What, could, what else could be over here? Cause I gotta find the other three rooms. No. I'm innocent. They're the bad guys here. <laughs> not me. No. What's in here? Oh, we got a hundred. Oh boy, a hundred bucks. I robbed you. <laughs> oh my gosh. And you too. No witnesses. No witnesses oh in gosh. this game. Imagine having to use a. If you didn't have the soul mask, and after you fight the hookshot, just shoot hookshot there, hookshot there, and then there. Nah! I just made this a whole lot easier. <laughs> and show you guys how to do it. Mini boss! Yep. That's as far as you go. Oh, hi. How unfortunate. You won't be getting past here. Alright. Whoops. Oh. Ooh, nice. That one jump strike. <laughs> Not bad. Don't think it ends here. Huh. Okay, so you you basically in a way, it's kinda like how uh you face Phantom Ganon actually. Because like you, you shoot him or no, you actually slice him with a uh, sword. And then he actually just disappears. And then if you're in, in another room, then he appears. Something like that. Alright, that's Zora egg number two. Hi, ah, you missed me! Yay! I got a heart. Hmm. Cool. Cool. I'm gonna need this again. Possibly gonna need this again. Careful, don't activate the bottle because then that egg. Oh, oh, don't worry. Like, once you get the egg, they stay in the bottle. Okay, then. You have to drop them off somewhere. Okay. So, they're, they're, they're pretty secure. Alright, this is. So, even, even though when you accidentally press the bottle um, button? Yeah, no, they're good. Okay. They're, they're definitely secure. Okay, so it's not those kind of games. Got it. Nah, we're good. So that was one of the areas where we need to go. Oh, this would be another one. No. <laughs> if you didn't have the storm mask, you could always knock him out with an arrow as well. Okay. Halt! <laughs> it takes courage to come see me in the pirate's fortress. I'm going to love doing this to you. Alright, let's do it. Come on. Haha, <laughs> jump strike. Don't think it ends here. Jump strike is the best friend, I swear. <laughs> Alright, cool, cool. We're making good progress here, ladies and gentlemen. We are making good progress. And you forgot the change. That's okay. I can just do this. It's just because of those... There you go. Yeah, it's because of those dark bushes. <laughs> See? All good. The power of the magic and... Well, you're dead. <laughs> I scored 20 bucks. Again. <laughs> yep. Yay. You got magic? Yeah, you got arrows. That's even better. Alright. One of the areas that's room number two or three because the the first or egg was right there where we got the hook shot. You know, that makes this actually makes this dungeon really easy. Mm -hmm. hmm. Okay. I see treasure chests. I must go grab. <laughs> that, that's why honestly I say how it's highly recommended to get the stone mask. Mm -hmm. it, it'll be your best friend. All enemies right here, even outside in the field, they won't bother you. Of course it won't work on bosses, that, that's that's an obvious fact. But enemies like this right here, nah, you're good. Okay. Now 
Was it this way or this way? Now keep the mask on. I'm gonna check. Yep, it was this way. Cool, on the first go. And of course you know you have to be stealthy. Nope. Nope. <laughs> oh man, I'm telling you, it's, it's, it's a lot of fun. Pult. Ooh, I like that green. <laughs> I know, right? Takes Courage Cup DV and the prize portraits. Oh, okay, same, same, same delight. Yeah, all good. That is a uh, nice shade of green, though. Come on. Come on. Come on. Do something. I know you want to do a jump strike. Oh, nice. You're the actual one to get a hit off me. Haha. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh, second. Oh damn. Ooh. Damn, she actually put up a good fight. Then again, I'm letting myself over by accident, so that's my fault. Oh, there you go. Nice. Nail dig. Hmm. There it is. I am full of money now. <laughs> nope. Excellent. Cool. Hold on. Turn around. Actually, I don't need a bottle with you. Alright, we got the fourth and final Zor egg here in the pirate's, uh, uh, Pirate's Fortress. Nice. You missed me, you missed me. <laughs> Alright, cool. And now we're to drop them off before we can proceed on. I will see you at this spot in just a moment. Alright guys, we're back here in front of the, the observatory. Oh, no, I'm sorry, not observatory, my bad. The Marine Research Lab. Just warp back over here and you had to come inside this place. And then we see this character. They're like, what are those Zoras doing? Hmm? What is it, boy? Did you also come to watch the Zora eggs hatch? I'm excited about it too. But those important eggs haven't arrived yet. It takes about one to three days from the time Zora eggs are laid for them to hatch. But they aren't kept in this aquarium until then. They may die. The reason for this is that the recent abnormal weather has caused the ocean temperature to rise in this region. Zora eggs are very sensitive to the changes in temperature. The only way that the eggs can hatch is if they're placed in this aquarium water, which is I set aside for them long ago. The Zoras are well aware of this, but they're still licked. I wonder if something has happened at Zora Hall. So they did indeed happen. Now come up on top of here. And like I said, the eggs are definitely kept sealed inside until you can climb up here. Oh, okay. Just gotta set all of them down. <laughs> Here's our fourth egg. Now we're missing three more. Hmm. It's the seven chaos emeralds. I'll stop. Seven chaos emeralds. I am going to like boop you. I swear. <laughs> <laughs> but it is so. You said They're you not seven eggs. Seven chaos emeralds. Do they look like seven dragon balls? Do they look like uh, gemstones to you? <laughs> No, but then we got seven Dragon Balls, and then we got seven Chaos Emeralds. I'm going to boop you, I swear. Now that we got four of these guys, I'll see you guys right over there at the Fisherman Hunt. So, one second. Alright guys, so we're back here at the Fisherman Hut. I know we were here before, and check this out. Speak to the seahorse, if I remember you talked to him first. Help me, please. Take me, take me back to the waters near... 
uh, Pinnacle Rock or Pinnacle Rock. I forgot how you pronounce that. Are you interested in that fish? It's a rare fish, isn't it? It's called a seahorse. I caught it swimming around here just off Pinnacle Rock. Since it's rare, I was thinking of selling it at the town carnival, which should be starting soon. If you want, I'll give it to you. On one condition. Do you have a pictograph of the female pirates? And that's why I say it's important to get a picture of the pirates. Hmm. Is any of the pirates and that's it. Oh, that's it, that's it. I had a picture like that. Well, aren't you a crafty one? You'll give that to me, won't you? In exchange, I'll give you this. You got a seahorse. Hurry, take it to its home at Pinnacle Rock. It's like, kill, kill me. Hurry, take me back to the waters near Pinnacle Rock. <laughs> take me back to the water. This is killing me. <laughs> <laughs> it's killing me. I've been dying and suffering through this little tank. <laughs> I need to go back home now, please. I need to go back home now. I can't be here anymore. <laughs> Just the most suffering uh, seahorse ever. Yes. Now, now that we got um, the seahorse, come swim all the way over here to you see those those two pillars that are right over there. That is where the entrance to Pinnacle Rock is at. Okay. I love the animation for Zora Link here. Yeah. Here, right here, how it's set. Pinnacle Rock ahead. Beware, murky water and sea snakes. Pinnacle Rock. Come down here. Now we can we can't exactly just swim through. No. We need to bring this guy out here. This little fellow will guide us. Under the sea. You have strange powers, Link. I have a request for you. Please, follow me. Follow alongside this guy. You can just swim through instead of walking. But I feel like because how, um, how fast he quickly goes, we just press the A button. It can possibly throw you off, and then you have to start back at the at the entrance. So honestly, I recommend just to follow him on foot. There you go. Here in the depths of Pinnacle Rock lives many dangerous sea snakes. My friend is trapped here. Link, can you please find a way to rid of the area of all the sea snakes and help my friend? You betcha. Whoops. Please do this for me, and if you all need anything. Don't worry, I got you, I got you. Down here, this big, um, this big hole that's here. Oh, wow. Hey, yep, there are sea snakes. You see that guy? That is one of them. Of course, come up to the side. Gotcha. And, voila, two hits. Take them out. And notice right here. Oh, Zora egg. Yep. The other three Zora eggs are in this area in Pinnacle Rock. Gotta find them. Not also, also not only just um uh, finding the three Zora eggs here, but also if you were to um clear of all the sea snakes, you do get a reward for helping out that seahorse. But while we're at it, we might as well take him out. Okay, that one. Oh, fudge nugget, I almost got it. The choppers. Fire! Nice. Hot, there's another one. Good. Might as well just keep uh these spares out. Good, there's another sea snake right over there. 
making good progress, y'all. We're making good progress. I gotta say, we're good to record again. <laughs> Aside from the usual of, of life, like work, spend time with misses, family, and all that jazz. I've also been playing games. Also been, also been, uh, been continuing to play more Xenoblade Chronicles 2 on my hands. So I, I'm having a blast with that game, that's for sure. And then even before that, I was also doing some animating as well, which is the recent one before this. So if anything, I would say go ahead and check it out. It's, and for those who don't know, it's just 30 second animation number 10. Other than that, that's all I've pretty much uh, been doing. It's been, it's been fun. Enjoying my time, you know? Yeah. <laughs> All right, all right, we're making we're making good progress. Good, good, good. Hello. I don't know if this is the last cease or not. There you go. Oh. Night time is approaching. At the same time, I see treasure chest and no background music for this either. <laughs> Okay. Should be more sea snakes, yes? No? No? Okay. Maybe right around down here. This should be the last one of anything. There we go. And... Oh. I know, right? I'm close. I was getting close to its chompers. <laughs> No, never mind. That's the last sea snake. Man, I think the last um Zora egg should be there. Yep, I, I see you. There you go. Hey. We save your friend now. Aw. <laughs> Now before I grab the Zora egg, talk to them, shall we? Thank you, Lee. This is a symbol of my deepest gratitude. Aww. And that's our reward for helping them out. You get another piece of heart. You have assembled a new heart container. Yes. Nice. Now let's just grab our prize. All right. Now that we have the rest of the Zora eggs, I'll see you guys at the Marine Research Lab. Jump, cut, go. Huh. I forgot about this part, y'all. Hold on, the Zora wants to say something, I think. Huh. Uh, Mikau, haven't seen you... I mean, uh, Mikau, haven't you seen any gold-colored fish around here? Gold-colored fish know this area very well. Oh, wait, they're talking about the seahorse. I was thinking of getting one to guide me to Pinnacle Rock. If the water wasn't so murky, I would have to rely on the guidance from a gold-colored fish. Okay, back to where we were. All right, guys, we're back here at the Marine Research Lab. Let's just get back up on that tank and just release the rest of the Zoras. Nice. Whoops. Sis. <laughs> oh, yeah, sometimes you have to stand in a specific spot to release the eggs, not just simply be on top of the tank. Oh, okay. Kind of, kind of dumb a little bit, but it's not really a big deal. Pikachu? Thank you, Pikachu. <laughs> Oops. Nah, I'm keeping you on. Good reason for, for this moment. Oh. It's not a, a big thing like optional. I just choose to have it this way. <laughs> and all right, let's get the last egg now, shall we? Good. All of the eggs have been brought together. It's going to start. Quick, come to the front of the aquarium. Oh. oh, little babies. Mm -hmm. These are the Zor babies, Aww. and this is how they look like temples. <laughs> look at this. What does this mean? Aww. What in the world could this mean? I've got it. Don't you understand? The way these Zor children have lined up, 
it means boots. You gotta stand in front of them. Okay, maybe not that. Okay. Let's see. Don't have some kind of. Yes, I do. I did. Eh. Okay, thank you. You play the new way bossa nova. This is catchy. Like jazz. Hey. You learned the new wave bossa nova. Hey. It's the melody taught by the Zora children that invigorates singing voices. I like how they're like just all like wagging like that. It's cute. No. That! Yes! It's that instrument! Hmm. If these Zoras were born to teach this song, then hurry! You must play this song for the Zora who laid these eggs. I'll show you them in just a moment. Be right back for a moment, guys. Alright, guys. Back from our jump cut. And what we need to go next, like the doctor said, go and play that song to the Zora that laid those eggs. We're gonna head right over here. Oh, you miss no. me with that bullcrap! Alright, come right over here. And, and F you. See that area over there? Yeah. That's where we need to go. We could just go underneath, but we could also just go around. And as you can see, I went to go recharge my uh, magic and also uh, deposited some rupees while I was in the jump cut. Okay. So come right over here. There you go. And you see a Zora right there. She's the one that made the babies? Yep, she's the one that made the babies. But first. Alright, another owl statue that we can travel. Yay! No way. Now come over here. Yes, Pikachu. Dot dot dot. Let's put on Zora Link. And he's still sad. Oh shoot! Uh. I'll 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 do it. Um, yeah. Hold on. That, that sad face is trying to tell you something. You can see it in an expression. Come on, y'all, let me just uh, reply something real quick. Not gonna take that long. Alright, quick edit. Alright, now that I did that real quick. Uh huh, quick uh, expression. So, all you do is you, you gotta play the song. She's the one that laid the eggs. Huh. She made eight babies? No, seven babies. Oh, she made seven babies. Yep. Turtle that you would see in Smash Brothers Melee? Yeah. This is that turtle. And now that you played the new wave bossa nova, you'll get this little cutscene and you get this. Oh. 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 I slept quite well. I just realized this when I opened my eyes. The passing of days is quite quick, isn't it, Lulu? Yes. yes, Lulu. It's nothing to be surprised at. Although my eyes were closed in sleep, I still see everything that occurs in this ocean. Hmm. It seems Lulu is confused. <laughs> Incredibly. 
There is no time for idle conversation. Now then, proud Zora warrior. The open seas of Great Bay have need of your might. Quickly, climb onto my back. This is the only way to get to the next temple. And that's why the hookshot is needed. So you can hookshot onto the trees and this turtle will take you to Great Bay Temple. Oh. And then right here... Mika? What's going on? My voice. What happened to me? Yep, it's odd. And now here... Why so slow? Hurry up and fire your hookshot into the palm tree on my back, Link. <laughs> of course I know your name. Didn't I say that all is seen by me? Alright, as much as I would love to do the temple next, we're gonna stop right here. Cause after this, we're gonna do some side questing before we can get down to the main temple. And it still will be worth the wait. So with that being said, I'd like to thank all you guys for tuning in for watching this next part. We'll get to the next part whenever we can with the recording, you know? And um, if you haven't subscribed, please hit that subscribe button. Also, if anything, go subscribe to my wife's channel too. Show her some love and support as well. Thank you very much. Leave a like. That'll also be appreciated. If anything, heck, it'd also be appreciated if you would leave a comment as well. And if you don't want to miss anything else from me, hit that bell button too to get the notifications for any other well, future videos from me. So with that being said, this is HyperShadic01. Also, Deku Queen 01 And we will see y'all later in the next part. Y'all stay blessed, everybody. Take care. Bye. Bye.